This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at Taxol. Taxol is an anti-cancer drug used in chemotherapy. It is classified as a plant alkaloid, a taxane, and an anti-microtubule agent. Taxol is used for the treatment of breast, ovarian, lung, bladder, prostate, melanoma, esophageal, as well as other types of solid tumor cancers. Taxol was first isolated from the bark of the Pacific yew tree, which is a slow-growing tree found only in the northwest region of America. Once its anti-cancer properties were discovered, concern was expressed about the effect on the yew tree population. The bark of the yew tree contains a very small amount of Taxol, which meant that initially the supply of the drug was limited and the process was non-renewable. For example, one kilogram of bark was required to produce just 10 grams of the drug. A semi-synthetic route was developed in which a precursor of Taxol, which is known as 10-DAB, was isolated from the leaves of the European yew tree. This route gives a higher yield of 0.2%, which means that up to 50 grams of drug can be produced per kilogram. However, the conversion of 10-DAB to Taxol requires a complex series of steps and the use of a range of solvents and organometallic reagents. Recent studies suggest that Taxol precursors can be synthesized by genetically engineered organisms. Next, we look at the structure of Taxol and identify some of the functional groups. So we have a phenyl group, we have a carboxamide group, we have a hydroxyl group, and we have an ester group. Taxol has low solubility in water. So from the structure, we can see that it only has three hydroxyl groups, which means it has low solubility in water. Water solubility is important because a drug must be fully dissolved to be safe for injection. To increase its water solubility, Taxol is dissolved in alcohol with the addition of polyoxyethylated castor oil. 